Hi, I've got a slightly different video today, uh, which all revolves around this interesting looking parcel uh, that I received in the post today from Mantic Games. I had been backing the Star Saga Kickstarter, which is at the time of the video uh, still running, and one of their updates had been to run a competition to select a few people to create an unboxing video for the retail version of The Walking Dead All Out War. Um, so to my great surprise, um, I was one of the three people selected, so we're going to do an unboxing video. Now I'm not sure what to expect here, so this could be interesting. Let's see what we've got. Get rid of the box. That's cool. That's a cool box. Let's have a quick look. Okay. That's excellent. I'm, uh, I'm going to remove the slightly shiny plastic wrap off of this. So, here's the back of the box. Six survivors, walkers, rule book, mm, scenery counters, yeah, all good stuff. Okay. Do the proper unboxing bit. All right. Hmm. Excellent. So it looks like we've got our quick start rules. Counters. And we've got some uh, some lovely looking models which are all pre-built so that's nice. Excellent. Okay, let's have a quick look at all the models because I love the models. Okay, I'm going to start off with uh, having a look at each one of the zombies very quickly, or the walkers. That's nice. It's nice. Um, there's no mold lines on that. It's all one piece of plastic to look at. Very good. I like the poses. I thought the, uh, the actual show is excellent, and uh, yeah, I think they've managed to capture the uh, character of the undead there. That's great. Oops. 
this one. <laughs> it's kind of strange because I'm looking at these for the first time, but I'm mostly looking through the camera because I'm concentrating on that, so it's uh, it's quite a curious sensation. Let's have a quick look at the uh, survivors, or not as they might end up being. Here we go, that looks like Carl. Again, I'm I'm really impressed by the quality of the the miniatures, considering that they are plastic, one piece. Oh, hang on. Um, huh. Ah, oh, right. Okay. So I assumed that all the things on the bottom row were uh, survivors, but not some of them are, are walkers. Cool. Slightly wonky back there. <laughs> no. Quite imperiously pointing over there. I don't know whether he's supposed to be telling somebody to go over there or pointing out zombies. Nice. Okay, this is cool. So uh, you've got some, some cutouts of uh, barricades and vehicles and that sort of thing. Yeah, yeah this is very cool. This, uh, various counters here. That's a good thick card. That's nice. survive? Um, probably not. <laughs> yes. <laughs> quick start rules. We love quick start rules. Oh, it says you. Character names. Learning to survive. <laughs> yes, that's a really nice, uh, nicely laid out 
quick start guide looks yeah, decent quality, nice and simple. And the actual rule book. Yeah, that's the sort of scenery I imagine that you'd want to build up to. Um, but <laughs> yeah, this is uh, this is a lovely, lovely book. Some uh, some decent photos and. Um, style cool here yeah, ah we got some more oh, a ruler uh, and some more cardboard scenery and counters and a badge hmm. Uh, this is something that uh, if you you can see, well, I don't know if you can see in the background here. This is one of the mats from mm, Dead Zone. Um, you see, this is a, a similar sort of size. Oops. Raw one of doing an unboxing. Don't drop the minis. We have. of some design and some dice dice dices and several different sizes of cards so we've got uh, uh, there's a points value so presumably you select what you want to take at the start Yeah, really nice. Yeah, so there we go, really cool. Um, nice box set. Uh, get some really decent models in there. I like the rule books and the, uh, the decent counters, nice decent card counters, nice thick card. Um, so the quality of the plastic minis is surprisingly good. I just wanted to thank Mantic for um, running this competition, which is very kind of them, and, and um, uh, to wish them luck on the Star Saga Kickstarter, which is still ongoing at the moment. And um, that's it. No!